Oscar winner and lifestyle influencer Gwyneth Paltrow took the witness stand in a Utah courtroom today to defend herself over claims she recklessly crashed into a man while skiing in 2016. Paltrow is countersuing, claiming that the plaintiff is trying to exploit her celebrity. Danny Backus has this report. We'd like to call Gwyneth Paltrow. From the witness stand, Gwyneth Paltrow and repeatedly told her side slide. of the story about what happened on a Park City ski slope seven years ago. I was skiing and two skis came between my skis, forcing my legs apart, and then there was a body pressing against me. Paltrow claims she and 76-year-old retired optometrist Terry Sanderson then crashed to the ground at Deer Valley Resort, her body landing on top of his. I said, you skied directly into my effing back. And he said, oh, sorry, sorry, I'm sorry. But Sanderson says Paltrow ran into him, breaking four of his ribs and causing lasting brain damage. He's suing her for $300,000. She turns her head up to look at her children. As she turns her head back down, she screams, then skis back into the back of Terry Sanderson. On Friday, Sanderson's team tried to paint the Academy Award winner and CEO of Goop as uncaring and elitist. You didn't leave your name, address, contact information. You didn't fill out any paperwork in connection with this accident. Eric did on my behalf. After the incident, you skied down, went to lunch, and then my understanding is you got a massage. I still felt very shaky and my knee was bothering me, my back was bothering me, so I decided to go in early. Paldrow was skiing with her son and daughter that day. Her legal team could call them to the stand next week, along with medical experts, ski instructors, and Sanderson. Her lawyers also promised to show the eight-member jury an animated reenactment of the accident. She is countersuing for a dollar plus attorney fees. Donya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles. Sanderson originally sued Paltrow for $3.1 million, but a judge threw out that lawsuit.